we're not going to give up. On the contrary, we're going to redouble our efforts. And it's thanks to people like Ted, who don't have to do what they're doing. I, that's, I, that's my job. I get paid to do what I'm doing. He doesn't get paid to do this. He does this out of the goodness of his heart because he believes that we have to create more tenuous than we will. There's a famous tweet going out. They said, how can I help? Now I'm asking y'all, I want you to ask World Memorial, how can you help? I want you to ask the city of Miami Gardens, how can you help? I want you to ask the city of Opelaka, how can you help? I want you to ask the city of Miami Lakes, how can you help? I want you to ask the county, how can you help? And ask Tech Knowledge, how can you help? Because I can't do this by myself. This can be a great idea, but it takes all of y'all to make this a great impact in our community. And the only way that's gonna happen is each and every one of y'all get involved and make sure that this just gonna be a great day with press and all that kind of stuff and then stop here. We're not trying to put a barrier on our, on our community. We're trying to make this free. I'm talking about, I want our community to come out here and be able to learn and educate themselves with no charge at all. That's what I'm, I'm here to do today. I'm not trying to make it fair. I want kids that attend Florida more to be able to send money back home to their family. We're trying to flip this. Instead of mom sending their kids money, we want the kids to be able to have an opportunity to be able to provide for their family at an early stage. Not when they graduate, while they're here on campus. That's what we set the goal to do. And it can be done. This opportunity of a lifetime, we haven't had this. Two years ago, we wouldn't have had this opportunity. And I need our community to get involved. You want to know how you can get involved? This is it. This is the beginning, y'all. Tech is here in South Florida two years ago. We didn't have it like it was here today. And I need us to find out. I want to have this campus so full that it overflows into open water. That's what I want. I want to overflow into Miami Lakes Tech. That's walking this one. I went to high school, we can walk from Miami Tech, Miami Lakes Tech to flow. I want to see kids from Miami Lakes Tech attending here, coming out to school, getting it done. I want kids from Carrot City to come here. I want kids from America to come here. I want kids from North. Because we can get this thing to overflow into Miami Gardens, overflow into Open Locker, overflow into Miami Lakes. That's what it's all about, y'all. I want our north, south, east, and west to let it overflow. And we would call Open Locker and say, hey, it's full over here. So we need a building. We need another tech up. I want to call Miami Gardens and say, it's full over here at Flomo. We need another tech up. I want to call Miami Lakes and say, it's full over here. We need another tech up. This is what we're trying to build here at Flomo. I'm not trying. That's what we're going to do here. And I appreciate it, and I thank God for just blessing the vision, but we're just getting started, y'all. This is a marathon, and we're at the starting line. we got a long way to go. We are trying to create prosperity. We do want a people in our community to be successful. We're not going to back down from that. We're not going to just focus on the expense side of the equation. We're not going to just focus on government helping people with their costs. We're going to focus on empowering people. And it starts right here. And it starts right now. And so for me, it's an enormous privilege to be able to announce a $50,000 commitment uh, to Florida Memorial University today. And one of my goals is to transform Florida Memorial University into a premier urban serving historical black university. Yes, to establish Florida Memorial as an epic center for advancing innovation and technology and entrepreneurship. A center that focuses on building economic wealth, developing entrepreneurs and preparing talent for the global, global marketplace, especially in technology, esports, cryptocurrency, cybersecurity, renewable energy, and so many more. So as we move into the future, there'll be more tech jobs and even more of a need for tech professionals. Tech is driving our, in, our, our innovation fields like modern medicine, transportation, and finance. Our kids need to be part of this innovation, and I know through this, through Florida Memorial University, our kids will get that opportunity. This is, this is a big day because it's the beginning of something. A lot of times we hear that, that phrase, a rising tide lifts all boats. Sometimes we forget that we're the boat makers. Technology is the tide. It's our ability to actually point to kids that will allow them to be ahead of the curve, not learning about coding after everybody that moved on from coding. Not learning about cyber security after everybody that we on the next, we on the next form of technology, they on the last one. 
that's how we that's how we disadvantage communities going forward. This is how we make the playing field easy. This is what we do. It's good hearts, good minds, resources coming into this school, coming into this community, and believing that we can be both members in just the university.